Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to World of uh, <laughs> World World Forge Legends. Legends. And we're back again. Uh, three versus one, a comp stomp against a hard AI. Uh, we shall ha see how this will fare. Uh, previously played against uh, three versus three, an easy AI, and so on. And we shall see how this will fare. As mentioned before, they might be hard than us. Oh, yeah, hold on. I need to make some more villages too. And capture more land. Resources. Construction mm -hmm. complete. If you're not fast enough, the AI is gonna camp it. Yeah, and that's not something I want. Give me a piece of bread. Oh yeah, I'm capturing my first own ones. Construction complete. Here we go. So you guys mm -hmm. playing the same thing? I'm playing mercenaries this time. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be sort of fun for me because like they're they're unique with all their like all their factions sort of combined kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, one one thing I like about Mercy is that I, that I put a lot of effort into fixing. It was actually a small fix, didn't doesn't mean much. But like uh, the, the thing I did with the Indian barracks, like which I'm gonna finish building uh, very soon, mm -hmm. is uh, you know how it has two exits. I've made it so that you can use both exits, mm -hmm. just like how you how the Spartans Acropolis works. So like you can, it doesn't matter how it's rotated, you can use both exits basically. So I think that's gonna help out a lot actually. Because like I remember how I felt about that barracks being like just only one exit and it was really Not annoying. Because like you didn't know which exit was the actual exit. Attack. <laughs> I cannot capture the point at the moment because there is uh here some more neutral enemies. So yeah, so gonna... so this map is a uh, very very um how should I say? Like at the start, it's it, the, the way this map, map works. It's at the start, it's really hard metal. to get ore because you have to kill metal. the neutrals. Not enough metal. But like late game, it's more like hard to get gold, even though you still have mines. You feel like you don't have enough. Our troops are under attack. But yeah, like these these uh neutrals in these ore mines that are protecting is they're slightly stronger. Uh, the thing is that that we wanted to like take a like a, so people have to like think what they're gonna do like they don't just blindly get the get the get the stuff like they actually have to build up a little bit and then like try try to take the point but like you have to be careful because like there's a big chance that you can get attacked while you're doing that so you can lose your army so like that was at least the idea behind it yeah uh, at least I have partially give some resistance against Egypt, but oh uh, well. As they are down there, I'm gonna I'm gonna send some units to like distract them at least. Ah, oh, not another metal. Yeah. As you can see, they just keep coming, and they yeah, also they like to build walls. Yeah, they certainly do. Yeah, I can see them trying to make some walls as well, but I'm creating a lot of units too. Not enough metal. Just trying to halter him. If they get Inaris, uh, you should try and like regroup next to a cap point so you can get HP region. Yeah, you got like, Inaris uh... is a that's Amos, and he Amos is like heavy infantry killer, while Inaris is on the horse, and he's like he wrecks. Uh, uh, light infantry, like he has bonus damage, but Inaris has not that much damage. But Amos has like uh, a lot of HP, so he's like tanky, so you have to like group up against him. Yeah, all right, uh, Rob, can you send some units? We, we need to help him. I'm sending my pack of slingers. I will build a barracks at this place. Yeah, go for it. Yes. But the thing is, you can actually make towers if you want to. They work. Just don't oh, really. Like at least I did not. I didn't. Don't know about any decent issue with towers. Throwing the machine shoot down towers though. So there's that. Not enough metal. Just some send some help. I'm, I'm gonna send some slingers to like harass the enemy at least from long range. Because uh, mercenaries have uh, basically the Indian workers as units, 
as like the lightest of light and they're like super fast so I can like kite them without many shoes really. Yes. Oh damn. Well I have myself beaten back, I cannot show some resistance, I'm quickly trying to uh pull my it's okay. Backs I'm sending I'm sending some back up, I'm sending some back up. Construction complete. Uh you need gold or something? Uh no, I need uh wood I guess, that's what it says. Yeah, that's or we have yet to change yeah. that. I'm just gonna. As it's not big of an issue, we didn't. We have yet to change that. It's yeah. okay. Oh, here they here they come. Important not stuff. enough metal. There is more important things. Exactly. Yeah. Oh wow! Oh, I'm getting wrecked. Yeah. They are powerful. Oh my god, so many <laughs> Bloody hell. Don't tell me I have to help you, no man. No, 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 just don't worry, don't worry about me. I'm a merc. I can handle it. I'm gonna try to make some more resistance if I can. I mean, Xerxes can tank it quite well, actually. They yeah, I know, any... but I just don't want to go in right now. I'll just wait for it. Till I have a little bit more men, or actually, just I'll try it. Actually, let me just try it. Yeah. No, you can do it. Just fine. Don't worry. Remember, like uh, when you hit a range as a melee, like you, they lose ninety percent of their damage. So. Yeah, and I'm keeping my people within the uh, flag Not thingy, enough. so I can. Yeah, that's important. Well, you can just tell me that they're there already. You don't. I thought they'd go full on Sharon now. Research complete. No, no, don't worry, they're not gonna tell me yet. Just yeah. uh, get, get a cu couple of troops on his position. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm I gonna. Have the pirates, man. Everything is. Okay, okay. Good, good. Not enough metal. Not enough metal. I believe Mercs have the. Uh, level up thing where they become better when they level up. So basically, what we did with mercs is that, as you can see, I'm spamming, spamming uh, Indian work and slingers. Mm -hmm. Usually, I'd never play that, play it like that. So, like Not in every other metal. faction, I'll never gonna, I'm never do, I'm doing this. But the reason why I can Not do it on mercs metal. is because uh, these Indian Not workers can upgrade into Indian militia and then into Indian warrior, so they can go a level like. From a civilian, they can become medium infantry if they get a, get enough XP. Nice. And they truly are spending now again. Yet, some, so am I. Not enough metal. Gotta get some Libyans. Our hero is under attack. Yeah, you should be able to handle it with Xerxes. And if when you level him up, just go for the strategic upgrade. Sure. I'm gonna do you. I'm gonna do you. Help him, Rob. Oh, now he's pouring in troops! <laughs> no help for that. Just, uh, you, you, just go. You, I recommend you go back to the cap point and just try and Not play enough it out there. Yeah, that's hard to for you. Oh yeah, you, you're Persian. If we had Egyptian, we could kill them with throwing machines. Okay, I Not don't think metal. I can handle this as well. Uh, I'm, I'm sending, I'm sending a distract army then. So, get distracted just a little bit. Yep. Maybe my weaponry will do it. Maybe not. I do have my men with some axes now, so that's good at least. But oh, they, they I don't have much resources. Ah, uh, I don't know. Is it looking good or bad? Ah, shit, I got a flag now. Yeah. Oh, close. Close. We were close. Nope. Oh, still too many. True. Uh, there's still some more here. Not Holy enough crap. metal. A lot of them. 
At least I have gained a gold mine, but oh damn, I can't create any Not more troops. Uh, if you want, you, to ch you can cheese them by sending one unit into mid, and they will chase him. So, yeah, you can do that. I'll try that's that. Gonna be, that's going to be fixed eventually, though, but yeah. Yeah. But they have that. They have the spirit shift buff. Yeah, they, they run faster. very fast. Yeah, spirit shift. Can be there, I'm making an oh shit! No, they found. It. No, it's okay. Let's see. Uh, go mid. Go mid. Uh, go mid, Rob. Go mid. Use the use those units and go mid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they Not chase you to mid. Use the road to move faster. I don't know. Do you know that? But like the road. On the map, it gives you extra movement speed. Yeah. I mean, it would be really obvious and logical. Not enough metal. I'll just now take over these weapons. Just keep running, Rob. Just keep running with the with the Macedonians. Fight with them. So as you can see, like mid has like four ore mines, but like there's um, a ton of ton of enemies there, neutrals. Yeah. Well, maybe we'll stand a chance. Maybe. Will be fun to see. Um, here. Oh shit, look what's in their base. Um, but they still <laughs> upgrade. <laughs> oh, yeah, they, they take it slow, but they sure upgrade. I think they build up to like. Their wave count goes up above 100, I believe. Huh. If I'm not mistaken. Not enough metal. The thing not was metal. like, we needed not a challenge. Metal. Like, we made easy, normal, metal. hard AI. Everything was easily wrecked. So we, <laughs> so we came up with something that's really hard. Yeah, it At really least. is. At least we come up with a new AI and don't say we have 40 plus AI like other people. And Someone is salty. <laughs> <laughs> like, how can you promise stuff and it's not in there? <laughs> like, it's sad basically. It's there, but it's not. No, I'm it is what it now. is. No, I just. You got battle axes? Yeah. I just took their weapons and using it. Nice. Just take the just take the ore mine and you should have a slide. But, but be careful when you attack that ore mine and if they build one they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna try and retake oh, it. Oh I think they got mid. They build a mine at least. Oh yeah yeah they got mid. Okay, I'm attacking mid, I'm attacking mid. Oh, at least I've also gained yet another barracks, so it should be good to oh, there's a lot of weapons laying down there, you can get those as well. Yeah yeah yeah. You can sell them actually. And you'll you can you'll get a lot of ore for it. Not enough metal. Not yeah, enough. Metal. I'd rather just build a uh, new unit from it. Well, honestly, I'd recommend you sell it because, like, from what I can see, it's all uh, low-level axes, which don't cost that much, but still worth. Oh, and the uh, weapons are disappearing slowly. Yeah, they got mid. I'm I'm, I'm attacking mid. So I recommend we all sell the units to mid because they're probably gonna metal. get here, and it's like we but can get a lot of ore mines here as well. Not enough. Sure. Research complete. Making some units. Now there's a throwing machine. Bloody hell! Take it, take it, take it, oh I have already an army. I'm coming now to mid. Holy nice. No, oh, I barely got it. That's okay. You guys can have those. Throwing machine. I got a throwing machine. Oh, here, he's sending baby. reinforcements now towards me. Oh, damn. Oh, crap. Throwing machine. I'm gonna send one throwing machine to assist you guys. Don't attack. Don't attack. So much. Go back to the flag. Sure. Ah shit, I don't have that big army yet. Let's see how fast they are there. Uh... Just try and regroup with the flag. Oh, he has Crescent Axe. Those Axe hurt a lot. And go behind the flag. It's better. Yeah. 
Ah, oh, damn. If only that hero dies, he has good. Done. Oh, wait. You're, doing, no, 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 no. you're not doing that bad, you're not doing that bad. Oh. Our throwing Someone machine is almost there. <sighs> almost there, throwing machine is almost there. No, that was not that good. Right. Not enough metal. Alright, throwing machine is here. Hero is under we'll assist as much as we can. Oh, Zex is dead. Research complete. Oh, damn. Oh shit, they killed my opponent. Holy shit, those fast units are annoying as like shit. Yeah. But I mean, that's a speciality. That's just how it is. Insufficient gold. Insufficient gold. I have fast units as well. They did destroy one of my barracks. <laughs> The one th the one good thing is about that my guys get better, bigger class when we level up, but even that is not gonna help us. Insufficient gold. Insufficient gold. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Rip. Really uh, unfortunate. He has a lot that? of troops. Oh, there's a lot of bonus. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think it's still doable. Doable? Not at all! Yeah, I need to get I need to get heavy Libyan warriors if, I, if we want to win this. Because they can tank a lot. Also building an army. Gonna try and send them down there. Their as well. range are so far too. Holy damn. Yeah, it depends on the wind actually. Okay. Very nice, very nice. It's unfortunate that you are next to them. Yeah. Do you need gold? Uh, not really. I just need to get my base cleared out and I'll can't build anything at all. <laughs> yeah, true. Okay, I no, no, it's not done yet. Our hero is under attack. Says we kill one by one. Okay, one more down. I think I already hear someone's death rattle. Oh crap. I can just send these guys in instead. Trying to make a new thing. Yes, right. Oh my research. I got two I got two throwing machines at least, so that comes from something. Construction complete. No, that doesn't help. I'm just getting wrecked on we are master of disaster. Okay, I'm sending my throwing machines down there. Make sure to steal that ore. Mine. Yeah, if only I could, because they're bombing all there. I can't get through. Uh, I'm sending throwing machines to kill at least a couple of them. I mean, worst case, you just build a base at my place. Yeah. Yeah, they got the throwing machines. That's unfortunate. Not enough metal. Oh wow, they killed everything. <laughs> Bloody <Our> hell! <laughs> are under attack. Our hero is under attack. Uh, what do we do? What do we do, boys? We're in a pickle. Uh, I'm Not just still creating metal. a few troops somewhere here. This ain't looking too good. Sell weapons to get some stuff. Probably. 
Got nothing. The yes. cell there. Research complete. I got some medium infantry at least, so I can sell that. So send that. Just I'm not send giving up on it. To my place, man. You're I'll getting. I'll try, old. but he's blocking yeah, yeah. me. Just try to get some workers up there, so you can like as long as you have a barracks, you you will not lose. Just need to sneak them behind somehow. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, he has Inaros too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 maybe you can do it. Yes, 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 now. Yeah, yeah, go, go, go. You can just hope that they go for the other workers. Mm, no. Nah. Hey. I'm down. That's annoying. I'll look up. Yeah, okay, that's uncertain. You want to restart? Hmm. Uh, no, I'm gonna actually now also play something else as well because I've been having two guys wait for me really, so. Alright, fair enough. Yeah, this is basically the hard AI, and especially those um, Egyptians are quite difficult, especially yep. with their speed and mess arrow uh, shot. Especially the Nubians can shoot very far as well, and that's really <laughs> strong. Well, uh, we focused on range. They are like range based, basically. They don't get any melee buff, like no melee damage buffs, apart from the knocking people on the ground. Mm -hmm. Ah. Unlucky. Yeah. How's he? I, I even got some medium infantry to, to send help. True. It's okay. Lose, you guys have been able to capture the middle again and uh, get the resources. Hopefully, you guys can defeat them. Yeah, they have a chariot. <laughs> they have a chariot, bloody chariot. I'm building up an army now. Let's hope it works. Oh, they have a couple of chariots. Mm. Yeah, yep. as you can see, it's, it's still not useless, but it it sure is easily destroyed compared to like how it is it, it, is it in the original game. Yeah. No, oh, that's nice. Oh, I'm wrecked. Uh, I can't do crap. <laughs> well, this is gonna probably be a long fight, so, like, thank you for playing our game. No mod. problem. I hope you liked it. Well, uh, I enjoyed it, but it was truly difficult. And um, as I mentioned before, it was truly something which I really have to get used to, as is uh, truly something different too. And uh, yeah, the difficulties and all that is also something really unique. And especially the way the units and factions work as well is something I really have to get used to as well, do some homework and so on as well, I guess. But um, How did it feel? Did it feel great, nice to play, or is it more like uh, it's so weird? I don't know. Uh, it's like I don't know. Basically, I don't know what I did, just did, and how I did, and how I even survived for that long. That's basically it. I've been trying to push those guys away. Same with the no easiest one, but I couldn't play it. Basically, play you it. you're skilled. You're already kind of skilled, at least. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we have some our people that just destroy their whole buildings when they. When their army gets destroyed. Yeah. <laughs> We've seen that happen. <laughs> We've Quite seen that happen so much that I want to disable kill button. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, good job for first time play. Yeah, 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 good job. Like, uh, I, I, I put, like, hard, on, especially on this map, like, some, some, AI, the, like, difficulty levels different. Are different compared to the, like map on this map like it's really difficult this one was like one of the main multiplayer testing maps so like we wanted to see just how hard the ai can be and just like you know like it, it can be harder than this which but it shouldn't be <laughs> that's for sure yeah. 
Well, as I mentioned before, like, in my opinion, like, the guys didn't really have much mines so far to my knowledge. They might have had this one down below here, uh, and same with these, so their income shouldn't have been too much to be able to support such a massive army. But they have been able to, and uh, that was because yeah, that, also that's they the had Yeah, that's the multiplier. Yeah, the mm. multiplier, exactly. We uh, we did make it a little bit more normalized, for, like as you saw like on that map when you play against these AI. Like hard is going to be still difficult. They're going to have a slight multiplier, but not like, not like they have on this map. Like on this map, we really cranked it up a lot. It's just to like try the 1v3, like because there's three of us. And, like we kind of wanted to see like if we can handle the AI and looks like we can't. No, it's impossible. We require to maybe uh, should have created some more troops quickly as well and run as quickly as possible as well and uh, that should have uh, been it's done. It's definitely difficult but yeah, I, I, I just hope you had fun like um, it's if, if, if you think that it feels like a completely different game we accomplished our mission because we, we sort of went for that mm -hmm. aesthetic as well. It did. It really did. Felt like a different game entirely for me, and uh, it's something like I'm not really skilled at it as at all. Like it, as I mentioned to you before, like it is basically a game that reminds me of Ancestors Legacy or Company of Heroes 2. But uh, this is my opinion. I definitely would say it really requires a little bit more balancing, especially with units attacks and. Uh, the way it is produced because hard AI, okay, you can be hard or you can be very hard and that's this. That's how I feel, that's my opinion. And uh, <laughs> because these guys are just numerous, I couldn't just beat them back and have a little bit of air to breathe to prepare defenses because they will come back and with a bigger army and that's how it should be, you know, you should be quick, sure. But you should also be able to have some air to breathe and be able to beat them back as well, tactically as well. And yeah, that's what I have not been able to. Sure, at all the games they have like always a front or a um... yeah. As persons, you have that uh, like a ballista thing that you can build up uh, mm -hmm. on base. Like that's the only pl plausible thing I think that would have probably helped you because they're light infantry and your thing and that thing like deals a lot of damage. So I think maybe that would have worked. But uh, considering that they attacked you so early on, I think I don't think you would be able to build it anyway. Yeah, but I couldn't. Now, but I didn't have said, resources this, either. Like yeah, I tried yeah, the, to. This catch is them. just like the AI here is just like as I said, we cranked it up to max, uh, just for like this kind of scenario where we try to like one v three because like um, we do try to balance stuff and all. But like um, when you when you actually play it at PvP, you'll see it's quite balanced. Mm -hmm. Like when you play PvP, it's balanced. Like. Uh, it's 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 a straight procedure like who gets better weapons in most cases is gonna win so basically who plays it fast quick smart you know like is, is gonna win but not always the case uh like um some there are some strategies like for instance when i play egyptians and there's like that berserker spell that ai don't use uh that for instance like even if i'm outnumbered i can like cast that before the enemy attacks and i can like have five seconds to like have extra damage and that kind of stuff so like uh, there's definitely strategy involved but yeah for persians uh, persians have the most uh, uh buff damage as in like that bonus damage when you do your upgrades so basically like your weapon upgrades your shield upgrades you get like m the most bonuses i believe mm -hmm. and uh yeah basically that's it like uh just it definitely feels like a different game that that was that was the goal yeah it definitely has that aspect. As I mentioned before, you have these flags, which I'm right now also looking at. They give you some resources, they give you some healing, like resupplying. That's what you also have within you know, Company of Heroes, just basically build up something there and get resources. Same thing with here. You build up some mines, you get automatically some resources produced within it. You just need to build up some uh, houses near that drop-off point and you get that automatically. No population is being taken away from it. We just basically, as I mentioned before, you capture the flag kind of thingy. And it's really fun. Uh, just want to mention that it might be really nice to see within the Persians that they should just have like a drop-off point kind of thing or a storehouse instead of a noble villager. A little bit of scripture changes, let's say that. Uh, further on is just you know as you mentioned last video as well that the uh, 
the range of the storehouse should be adjusted. That's what really needs to be worked on as well. Uh, sure, I guess if it's uh, if this AI is being made to basically focus for a three versus one, I suggest maybe like make a different kind of AI to call it a three versus a one AI, and just have yeah. the hard AI yeah. just to be hard basically because that will be really more nice because when you see someone else who comes in like hey this is a hard AI I tried to beat it then they'll be like oh what that feels me real bad I'm a bad guy then if I cannot beat him that sure at times you gotta you know think like hey it's a new game you gotta get used to it and you gotta learn from uh you know when you try out something newly and of course when you try out if there are you know constant losing or winning because again you learn from these kind of things as well and i've learned basically a lot as well from this gameplay as well to basically correctly try to rush build up uh, different ways of tactics as well um have to uh, also rush the little bit of access as well instead of previously i haven't done that and they do a little bit of damage extra and that's really good but i've not been able to make the rituals all at all because i lack the resources i couldn't do anything the enemy this AI just literally took my mind and it couldn't do anything. But he did rush up there and try to take over. Even if there was like some neutral people there, which attacked him constantly, he managed to get it eventually or push them as well back to. And it was nice to see as well. But I would suggest, this is my opinion as I mentioned before, to create a AI which is basically a part one and a short because then people will understand, hey, this is it this is how they function so you can just try it out in multiplayer as well because it's basically like a structure wish maybe i guess and uh, you know a sight seeing thingy maybe if you get what i mean and uh well further else i've not really had anything else to say because again i've not really played this game too much neither understand too much about the structure yet I still have to continue playing it on to get this entire structure, but it surely is a different different game uh, with uh, a mindset of how it plays and reminds you of different games as well for the others who might just also enjoy it as well. And also with different factions, I have to check out how they work. But I can definitely say that Egyptians are my favorite as well because I've played it many times within Spot Definitive Edition because, you know, as you mentioned, these archers shoot more better and they have... You know better bows because that's how their faction unique thing is and unique and lovely so yeah it's really cool to uh, play and try out because i can also see they have like three barracks over here right now if you can see it as well with me here hold on All right. and they're let me just uh let me just uh see if i can okay there we go yeah look at that they have like more than three barracks even four five yeah four even and they have swarmed it entirely. And that's really good to see. And it's entertaining as well. And they made the walls as you mentioned. Though it is really annoying that they just can't pass through here. Like there's always yeah, a little uh, gap. And that's just that's annoying. That's actually the path, the path the textures of the... We try to like uh, make the walls less uh, bulky. Mm -hmm. But uh, looks like but we didn't really finish that yet. So that's why they can pass. Uh, there was um, a slight issue with AI, which like concerned about these edges and stuff. And uh, yeah, the, you could they they wouldn't build walls because of those edges. So we try to like experiment and just make walls feel way better than what they are right now. Yeah. Still a work in progress though, but like we have a lot of stuff to to like fix and, and all. Yeah. But well, it's I, not I think right now it's it still it still feels like a solid solid mod in my opinion because like uh, if you try pvp you'll notice like just like those little things that that just stand stand out like like those faction stuff and yeah that, that's definitely it first game was always already fun to play as well i noticed that how i needed to change and all that and just got used to the persons i can play it but as well this ai is just how should i say insane but, insane but. it's it's fun it's fun but i'm like okay you gotta get even more to it and i don't know if ev anyone has ever at all beat them but probably no. impossible at this rate but then again the other ones was really cool and to play as well and i'm sure you know when we play this on a uh 
uh, you know, one versus one versus one or two versus two or whatever, yes, yeah. it would be really nice to check it out as well and to play. Of course, it's really fun as well. We shall see. I was how hoping to play a two v two, but unfortunately, TQ didn't join us. So yeah, it is. It that. wasn't uh, possible. But maybe next time we shall see how it will fare. Uh, you know, it's a fun mob. It is solid. It just needs a little bit of scripture work here and there, as I mentioned before, with the storehouse thingy. Uh, the adjustment with that technology house thingy here, uh, which I couldn't do. One thing is good, though. When I lost my forge, I couldn't research anything anymore. So that was also really nice to see. Like, it is logically kept up. Uh, for theirs, I've not really anything else to say. It was, you know, I would say uh, an 8 out of 10 mod that really is working solid. It's kept logical and uh, you know it there is common sense in, in everything as well just as I mentioned before just the hard AI make a different one call it a three versus one AI for example or a challenge or so or something like or make yeah, a we'll map make specific maps or map versions of yeah it. make a map where it says this is a map where you got a challenge against a hard guy because when you make an AR hard, it gotta keep hard, not just like hardest. You get what I mean? Like it's not like saying it's not really cool to challenge this. It is cool. It will be even lovely to one day beat them and have revenge on him. It will be really nice to do. And uh, as I mentioned before, like maybe it's some kind of a teamwork thing as well. And I felt like we did great. We did hold them off <laughs> as long as possible, but we can do it. And. Uh, I was the also thing was, mm -hmm. uh, sorry to cut you off, I just mm -hmm. wanted to say that the thing is like, uh, we did not have proper testers, like it's only been us and like sometimes we were able to beat them, like depends on how we played, like uh, um, the, the, the changes were constant though, I made the changes constantly, so some things are less OP as they were back in then, so like we definitely gonna turn down the the AI and all, but like we didn't have a proper input on AI difficulty because, like as you know, as you notice, easy AI felt super easy for us, but not for the common player. So yeah, like, not for me as well. I was like, what happened? I beat him back. He goes away for a moment and eventually comes back. That's really cool. That's really interesting to see as well, and that's real logic. I find him playable, the easy one, just the hardest. I'm like, okay, I can't even come back at all myself. I couldn't do it. We both yeah, we're gonna, definitely going to turn down the, the hard AI. Definitely I would say just down. make something else, like make a challenging map or something and then have him put in there or a separate AI and call him challenge, for example, or challenger or whatever and do it. And that will be really fun to do because as you mentioned, like this is how you guys play to have three versus one for the matches and it will be really fun to implement and also have fun with and, uh, you know, it is not that much leggy as well, uh, well for my PC, because it is a good one, I don't know how it will work for someone who has a, you know, lesser required uh, thingies I guess, but it is doable, uh, there's not much aura thingies coming around, that's really cool to see as well, because there, you have those auras as well within the game that just really shows off as well, and that's really annoying too, because this like reminds me that, okay, is this a fantasy game or something? And that's really amazing to see, only just within the uh, map that you can see the healing and all the, like, just a bit blinking. That's really cool, interesting too. Uh, would be also fun that the AI would try to also repair his things, because you can see... Oh wait, no. Actually, no, look, just check this out. I thought these ma buildings were damaged and need repairing, but that was a bit bugged. Yeah, that's, a, uh, that's a, the Sparta 2 bug Okay. That happens with this. Okay, well, further on... Now, don't really have anything else to say as we mentioned the scripture with the wood well it should be iron or tin yeah it's it's we it's basically called ore but you can call it iron if you want yeah. metal 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 would be metal tin whatever <laughs> oh yeah it's ore basically it just needs that thingy on top of it just scripture just add a 10 it's solid it gets uh, fun to play and it should be you know enjoyable for everyone else to do it as well and um, who knows we shall see further on I shall be here and be willing to test it out as well further on and have more fun with you guys and show off to anyone else they are free to join us as well for sure play around with this because uh, it will be a good potentials it, it has the potentials within it as mentioned before so 
Um, with that said, uh, if you guys don't have anything else to say, then we shall just end our game here. And yeah, sure. Indeed. All right. Well, anyways, Thanks for the game. that was a lot of fun, definitely. Likewise, and uh, anyways, I shall see you guys in our next video as well.